Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Gemini, April 16, 2022. The visitors may start coming again to your door, and this time they might not be as welcome as they were earlier in the month. You and your family are more interested in getting your lives organized together, which requires considerable effort. Nonetheless, you're apt to be very polite and congenial when your guests show up. You just aren't likely to protest very loudly when they first get up to leave. Enjoy yourself anyway. Children, or possibly some close friends or a love interest, may be upset today. The financial coffers aren't full enough to afford something they think they absolutely have to have right now. You might find yourself having to soothe their feelings, reassuring them that, not now, doesn't necessarily mean, never. If they don't respond, don't keep pushing. They'll have to come to terms with the situation in their own way. You should know perfectly well that it is not enough just to dream about things for them to happen. But are you sure you really do know that? Today you might want to think of getting rid of those kinds of false hopes that are still hanging around in your mind. It is much more realistic to believe that things happen for the people who work the hardest for them. Today you might find yourself planning a quick out-of-town trip by air. This could be business-related. Someone else may have been meant to go, but couldn't, and therefore you may be taking their place. This could be disruptive for you, but if you make an effort you can combine business with pleasure and turn it into an adventure. It's always best to go with the flow and make the most of it. Today is ideal for going on a long excursion with your friends. Take the initiative and organize a barbecue or picnic. Your friends will look forward to meeting up again to have a good chat and will show their gratitude to you. You'll all have a great time and have good memories of this special event. Your love life is a drag today, but you need to take extra care with it anyway. If you have a bad attitude about your day, things might get even worse than they originally were. Cheer up. Find your voice and don't miss this opportunity, maybe that special person you seek, your dream partner, is waiting for you to respond in a positive way. They seem eager to do everything possible to attract your attention and are set to make an appearance, don't allow a potential lover to leave you lost for words. If something doesn't make sense to you, question it. Be strong, bold, and confident. Don't let others take advantage of your soft, sensitive, and nurturing personality. Your general tendency is to give more than you receive, yet this may leave you feeling tremendously depleted. Put an end to this cycle. Be conscious of how you distribute your energy. Do something for yourself. Self-discipline may seem harder on this day than usual for you. The effects of this vibration can see you more scattered and easily distracted. But on the positive side, it can add a spring to your step and lighten the atmosphere considerably. If you can go about your day flowing with the natural feel of this day, you will find that you can get things done and enjoy yourself at the same time. Take the time to make plans for social interaction as well. Mars' departure from Aquarius today will take some of the heat out of this year and definitely the urgency but this is also the start of a seven-day transition period. In a week from today the asteroid Juno, the queen of commitment will leave, Saturn will be on his own and it will then be more about staying on course and standing by your resolutions for the coming year. Until then, with the spotlight now on her, this gives Juno seven days to channel Mars' passions, warrior and competitive spirit into the game plan and resolutions that Saturn can help you stick to. Nine days after Venus left Aquarius Mars, who has been carrying the torch for the planet of love leaves today as well. It was nearly six weeks ago that the planets of love and passion not only returned to your sign but spend their first six days here aligned, with Mars departure today wrapping up their mission to energize matters of the heart and the things that you are passionate about. Sometimes you tend to play the martyr. You are a hard worker and you surely pride yourself on your discipline and tenacity. But sometimes you take on too many responsibilities and allow others to take advantage. If at this moment you feel overloaded with obligations, say so. The situation will never change if all you do is suffer in silence. Talk about your concerns or ask someone to help you. And feel entitled to take a break. 
A dialogue from last month resurfaces. Now is the time to pursue it constructively. Despite a tendency to think too much, you will keep your balance by practicing a physical activity that chases away your tensions. Today, you are confident, you have a smile, you use your finesse of mind and your gentleness to get your messages across and you take a fresh look at everything that comes up. All the ingredients are there to thrive. Our eyes in the sky. We want to veer from all the outdated norms that are holding us back, slowly but surely, one step at a time. But it's imperative to add structure to your daily vibe. Once you're able to find stability in all aspects of your day-to-day -day activities, then you'll be able to feel confident in how to go about your tasks and work. On another note, your personal views and goals are shifting, which means that you long to change your inner world. Don't be afraid to step out of your comfort zone and make strides in your life. You don't have to leave the past behind completely, but you should try to embrace a more evolved mindset. This can allow you to see situations from a clearer perspective. In fact, you'll be able to understand matters in a less emotional way, which will help you make all the necessary decisions during this luminary. Lean into your higher consciousness right now and transcend to a place of understanding, compassion, and service to those in need. Over the past two weeks, idealism has been at the helm of our decision-making, but by leaving too much up to good faith, we can miss an opportunity to ground our dreams into a realistic container. Now, we're forced to get organized. Some fantasies will need to be let go, and some simply need to be revised and reworked to bear fruit. The moon opposes illusory Neptune, suggesting that we be mindful of our energy. Others may be depending on us to keep a vision alive, but how much are we being expected to sacrifice? An additional trine to Pluto facilitates looking beneath the surface of our engagements and questioning, what is it I am really trying to achieve now? How can I transform what I am working with and embrace its highest potential? At 1.11 am, the moon begins its void of course, lasting until around dawn. Take note of any symbolism in your dreams which could further illuminate full moon manifestations. Full moon insights are still being digested, but now, we are processing with one eye towards our relationships. Yes, a personal vision is coming together, but who else will benefit from its realization? An intangible idea only serves to bolster our own imagination. If we get serious and make the intangible, tangible, it becomes something we can share with others. This prospect can be a great motivator today. Although our intuition is enhanced, it can also be a liability. We may read the room wrong or misinterpret others' statements. Our own words can be misunderstood as well. This transit puts us in touch with liminal forces and creative energies. It inspires us to interrogate the meaning of life and ask questions about the nature of reality. It's a great influence for occult students and fans of high strangeness and fantasy lore to discuss their fields of interest. Insights come through during meditation, in daydreams, and by allowing our minds to wander. We should simply be cognizant of blurring the line between fact and fiction. Mysteries and make-believe can enchant the psyche or breed suspicion and paranoia.